We keep hearing about the shortage of personal protective equipment or PPEs for the men and women on the front lines battling this virus. Well, a local woman who created an antibacterial fabric for her fitness apparel line is now using that same fabric to help. Channel 2's Tania Wright has her story. We all have something that we can be giving during this time, even if it's calling us, you know, calling us people at the nursing homes to talk to them because they can't get visitors or, you know, pivoting from cakes to bread, fitness apparel to antibacteria face masks. I mean, there's a lot of things we can be doing that we just kind of have to think outside the box. And that's exactly what Megan Eddings is doing. We thought, OK, rather than have people wear a bandana or like whatever they can find, um, you know, piece of cotton, the Prima antibacteria face mask would be better than just, you know, something you can find in your drawer. She's using the Prima antibacteria fabric that she created for her fitness apparel brand, Excel Lifestyle, to now make face masks. Hashtag disclaimer, it is not an N95 mask, um, but people are wearing it over their N95 or if they're not like, let's say in an ICU or surgery or something, they're wearing it just in a lot of other areas of the hospital. So it inhibits the bacteria and inhibits your hands from touching your face. Edding says that you can wash the mask 100 times and it is still 98% effective in protecting you against the virus. So by this Sunday, we're gonna have 9,000 Prima antibacterial masks available. And then starting on Tuesday, we're gonna be making 9,000 per day. We have the capacity here locally to make 90,000. Eddings and her team are already talking with local hospitals about the face mask. We're talking to MD Anderson, Houston Methodist, Texas Children's, Kelsey Siebold, Memorial Herman. It's been unbelievable seeing just everyone, especially Houston, because I live here, just, you know, step up and just help in any way they can. And as we all know, Houston is a city that always steps up and comes together in times of need. Tania Wright, KPRC, Channel 2 News.